Hi everybody, it's Thursday, 5, 5 p.m. 68 degrees out, pretty nice out. Pretty warm, pretty nice. Just came out, sit on the porch. Got the door propped open for Stewie to come out. But she hasn't come out yet, I don't think. I don't see her anywhere. She was just getting ready to take a nap when I come out, so I don't know if she'll come out. Well, I got. I think I got my microphones working. I don't know what the heck was going on. See, I got it on there now. I have it on the middle. Noise reduction setting. That's why it's green. But see, it's not blinking. So it's working good. Don't know what in the heck was going on there. I fiddled and fiddled and fiddled with them yesterday. and I don't know what I did, but all of a sudden they just seemed like they started working. They come on and stayed on and... So far, so good. I did find out if I just take them out of the, if I just take it out of the case and plug the receiver into the phone or the transmitter, whatever you call it, that it just starts to work. I don't have to push any buttons or anything unless I want to put the noise canceling on. So anyway, fingers crossed they work good. I think they're really nice mics. They seem to work really good when they work. But now I think I figured it out. I didn't figure it out, but I got them working. So I come out, sit on the porch. Like I said, it's really nice. I got a coffee here and go smoke a cigar and just look in the backyard, see if we see anything. I'm going to turn you around here pretty quick. I picked six more tomatoes and then I'm going to show you. I'll turn you around and I'll tell you about my crazy day yesterday and today. Stick around. Okay, well, I got my... Look, I picked six more tomatoes. Boy, they're all... Per See, that one on the right, it's got a few blemishes on it, but those other five are just perfect. They're not real big, but they're... And they, they still need a little bit of ripening yet. So I'll let them... I'm going to take them in the house and let them go in and ripen a little bit. Look in the backyard. Let's look in the backyard, see if I'll zoom in as much as I can. In case something goes by, I'll keep moving you around a little bit. So I don't know what happened there. Are we back? Now we're down to 45 seconds. I don't know what happened. I hope it didn't screw up my video. They put a pause button on these phones now with ios 18 the new updates gotta be careful where i touch it well i hope that doesn't anyway <coughs> she said they had animals up there and i said well it didn't say that on the calendar you know they have a calendar that has all the events for the month and she says well you can't go by that anymore because the girl that was took care of the entertainment quit her job and they just brought in another girl a couple days ago so that calendar that I have is no good. So I thought, boy, there's a bunch of crazy things all happened in a matter of a couple of days, you know. And I still haven't got through to the bank yet. I put a notice on Facebook. I said, what the heck's going on with our bank? And uh, somebody got back to me and said that everybody was having troubles. And the Timberland said they were back online, but they're not. So I'm going to have to tomorrow hopefully get up there. I haven't been able to check my bank account for like three, four days. You know, I usually check it every day. I don't know what the balance is now. I mean, I bought some things, and I'd like to know what my balance is. I'd like to see if things cleared and all that. So it frustrates me. I mean, it's not a big, big deal. I ain't going to lose any sleep over it, but. So that's some little frustrating things. And I have no idea how long I've been on here because I bumped that button. Got to... Stewie didn't even come over to see her pumpkins yet. She didn't come out. I don't know where she's at. She didn't see her pumpkins yet. So I'm going to wait. I'm not going to... I'm not going to carve those out until... 
probably a, about a week before Halloween. And yeah, somebody, one of you mentioned about one of the TV stations running all the uh, Halloween scary movie types, and that's on, my, on where I'm at. It's uh, AMC, whatever that stands for. AMC, that's the channel that's running all the uh, Halloween stuff. And then they have quite a few on sci fi, too. So that's what I've been watching mostly today and yesterday. Oh my. And what else? Let me think for a minute. Yes, I don't have much else to say. I had leftover ham and bean soup this, this afternoon. Still got enough left over for a couple meals. It's better left over. Everything's better left over. Tasted really good today. And my tomatoes, I'm going to make them some tomatoes and cheese in the oven like I showed you that one day. I think that's probably the last. For sure, that's the last six that I'm going to get. We didn't get anywhere near having a frost yet. But I was watching a YouTube channel that guys down in the Missouri, uh, what's his name, the Prepared Homestead, and he said they were down into the 30s last night. That's craziness. And I think we got down, I think we were down about 50 last night, the coldest. I had a furnace on. So that's about it, I guess. I'm going to put these two videos together where I messed them up and hopefully come up with something. <coughs> just a, just wanted to check in with everybody. And if I forgot anything, let me know that I was supposed to talk about. I don't know, if I see any deer or any bear, I'll let you know. I'll get you in on it. So everybody have a nice Thursday night. Weekend's coming. Tomorrow's Friday. TGIF. Everybody have a great night. Stay frosty. Dale out. Well, I came back because when I went to edit my video, I must have hit that pause button or something. I'm not used to having that pause button there. Like I said, they put that in there new on the Apple uh, ISO 18 update. So I must have hit the pause or something because I lost a whole bunch of my video. Basically what I was going to tell you was about my my bank account. I know, I think I mentioned yesterday about having trouble getting in my account. And it wasn't, it had nothing to do with that Bank America thing, whatever that was. Because this is a federal credit union that I have. But it's having to do with their, I don't know, they're doing construction up there, they're building, they're putting in new systems or something, I don't know. But you can't even get through on the phone. I tried today. When you call, you get a recording, you get four options, not one of them is about talking to a human being. And I did put through, I, I you know, I just picked one and I waited and they come on with a, put me on hold and they said, I was number seven in the queue, so I wait and wait and wait and wait. I was on there 20 minutes, down to seven, down to six, down to five, and I kid you not, got down to one, and I thought, boy, I'm going to be next. Next thing she came on, and she said, you're queue number eight. And I thought, what the crap? So I hung up, and I tried it again. Same thing. Got to count down to one, and then they put me back up to four or something. So I just hung up. I'll have to go up there tomorrow. I wanted to go up today, but I took a shower this morning. I was going to go up there and do that at the bank and then go see my mother, but I just kept falling asleep. I couldn't keep my head up. I kept nodding off at my desk, and I decided I'd better not drive, and I called my mother and talked to her about it. She's okay. Everything was fine. 
And then my, uh, my prescription, I was supposed to get on the 29th, and generally my pharmacy sends me a, a message that it's ready, and they never did, so I called down the clinic and got the same ordeal down there, answering machine. You know, I can't believe that they're not that busy down there. It's not like it's a big city. And you can't have one person answer the phone, a real person. So anyway, I picked the button and went to the nurse's station, and as soon as I did, the answering machine there, and leave a message, and they'll call you back. So that's what I did. And then in the meantime, I called the pharmacy, and they, they made a mistake. They forgot to send me the message, but they did have my prescription ready. So I'll go pick it up tomorrow. Then the pain clinic called me back, and I said, well, I got it straightened out now. So that was craziness. So everything I got messed up was, I think, is still I got to get hold of the bank because it bugs me that I can't, I don't know what my balance is in my checking and savings. Like I said, it's a credit union, so I don't think it had anything to do with all that other stuff. Anyway, I think that's all the parts that I left out when I messed up my video. So once again, I hope uh, hope everybody has a great night. Weekend's coming. Stay frosty, everybody. Dale out for sure this time.